Three things to talk about. Repainting in mid-journey, one of the unsung heroes of continuity and character consistency. Runway Gen 3 Alpha introduces a turbo mode and Sync Labs, the lip sync tool, has got a new version out. Are we getting ready to make a video about what a brilliant thing repainting is in mid-journey and how you can repaint jewelry and make it consistent shot to shot to shot and hairstyles and costumes and backgrounds and it was all looking good because I've had some great examples in the past and then this week mid-journey updated repaint bundled it into a new area uh, that it's the editing area and I, that's great but then it doesn't work quite so well so I was trying some examples to make sure that they were still working fine Mm, they weren't except for one thing that I've still had some really reasonable results with and it's worth telling you about and that's to do with eye control in narrative filmmaking where the character looks is really 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 important so just to show that repaint can still be useful <laughs> and it's great for eye control. So I was looking at a couple of options. What happens when you've got a character looking in the wrong direction and you need them to look at the character or somewhere where you need them to look? In my case, I need them to look at the person that they're talking to. I thought, well, let's try it with the whole face. I'm told that it doesn't work quite so well if you just do tiny areas. So I thought, okay, let's try a big area. Problem is, I did this whole big area and the faces were all different every time. It was really rubbish. Now I still need the faces to look the same so I gave it a try and I did the tiny little areas around the eyes and I got these results. One in four was useful and that is good. I'm grateful for that. That will work. I can work with that if I can at least get one in four that's looking like they're talking to the same person with the eye direction. You just have to give the character a direction as to where the eyes should look and who they should be looking at not don't look here, don't look there. So then I thought, let's give Runway a go with the new Gen 3 Alpha Turbo mode. And whew, it really is fast. So why would you not use Turbo? Well, the quality isn't as good. It's a trade-off. You can either have lower quality, fast, or better quality, slow. These are the examples I had, and this is how they were looking. Sync Labs. Since they've just updated the version of their software, I thought let's give that a try. So I pulled in the results from my Runway Turbo experiments and I thought, well, let's compare the bloke who was the, on the other side of this conversation with the results that I got from Runway last week. Stick them both together so the two of them are kind of speaking opposite each other and it looks like this. Well, beat fat, hairy boo-hoo. Take a hike, little boy. You're sniffing around the wrong flower bed. Uh, right, but look, here's the thing. I can't even do my job anymore. I mean, what use is a security guard who can't touch shoplifters? One plus for Sync Labs is that the free version, it really does give you a lot to play around with. Well done, Sync Labs. Keep it up because we need to buy into these tools if we're ever going to risk paying the big monthly subscriptions to use them professionally. 